Let's look at the course synopsis. Course has eight sections, and in the section one, there's an introduction about the course and what are the requirements for this course. In the section two, we will discuss cryptography and fundamentals, historical ciphers, symmetric, asymmetric ciphers, and integrity will be discussed in the section two. In section three, we conclude our cryptography discussion with the asymmetric cryptography and I introduce some hands-on experience in this part. In section four, we start our cryptanalysis discussion. In section five, we continue our cryptanalysis discussion. In addition to that, I provide some hands-on experience in the section five. Section six is how you use this cryptanalysis tools and techniques in the cybersecurity. In section seven is about all the new advances in cryptography, quantum, post-quantum cryptography will be discussed in the section 7. And the section 8 is the conclusion for the course. For the prerequisites, there is no prerequisites for this course, but an understanding about some computer science topics is helpful. And also for the cybersecurity experience, penetration testing, malware analysis and incident response is closely related with this course. Preferably, we use some Python. so. It's good to know some Python code. If you can read a Python code, it's okay. So it's a, not a beginner level course, but it's, a, it's not a very hard course as well. What you will learn in this course, securing information through encryption because we have an encryption discussions and then cryptographic techniques. And I will introduce how to break codes and what are the techniques for breaking any encryption. And we continue and discuss about uh, assessing the strength of cryptographic systems and what are the advanced new technologies in the cryptography. So with this, let's start our course.